Good evening, guys. So I didn't even know if I was in the right group. <laughs> so I had to go out, make sure I was in the right group because I specifically wanted to come in here. But I had a thought and I haven't been live in here for a minute. All of you should know if you're in the group who I am. But just in case you don't, I'm Tanya Wilson Cherry. I'm a growth strategist, business coach and mentor to women just like you. I help you brand, build, and profit in your business, right? And as well as that, I work on abundance mindset, personal growth, and business building. And I had this thought, and I said, I'm not even going to wait. I'm just going to go and get in flow of what I'm thinking while I'm in alignment with it. So my first question that I want to ask you before I get started is, are your beliefs keeping you from hitting your goals? Are your beliefs keeping you from hitting your goals? So last year, well, first of all, I have a bigger goal that I want to achieve financially in my business this year. And I was sitting and thinking, <clears throat> you know, what am I going to do? Well, I have the strategies that I want to do and the things that I want to do, but I knew that something was missing. So last year, around maybe February or March, I had this thought about a program that I wanted to do. Now, mind you, I had been sitting on the program for about a year and a half. How many of you have something on your list you've been saying that you were going to do? Hey, Denny, how are you? And that thing just kept rolling over from one year to the next and one year to the next. How many of you have ever had that? This was me with this particular thing. And um, put me in the comments if you've ever, you know, had something on your list and you like, this has been up here for some years and I have not moved forward on it. Okay, that was me. And one day I said, I'm doing it now, right? And there were a few things that I did and I teach this to my private clients. There were a few things that I did that helped me to shift and get into alignment with what I was saying. So what happened, I created what's called a mastermind. I'm not enrolling people for that or anything, but I'm just, y'all follow along with me, right? As I share um, what transpired and what made me even come in here to share with you all tonight because I understand how much our thinking holds us back. So I have been saying, no one's gonna wanna invest in themselves on that level. Um, can people afford it? All the things, all the questions that I could think of, all of the limiting beliefs that were keeping me from actually doing it. Now, mind you, I had created the program. It had been sitting for about a year. I'd already done a beta of it and everything, but I knew the value of the course was a premium price. And so I battled with all these different thoughts. And then finally, finally, I got in full alignment in my thinking and I went through these uh, four steps and do you know now mind you my highest program at that time was around a thousand dollars prior to that this program was 6k so there was an increase of about five thousand dollars for the product or the service that I was offering the moment that I got in full alignment with it and I say moment but it wasn't exactly a moment but it was less than a week right? I signed my first person. Now, I'm going to tell you, not only did I sign my per first person, I just kind of mentioned it to someone, what I was doing, what it would entail, and they said yes. And I said, wait a minute, I don't even have a button, a page, or any of that. They said, I don't want to miss out. I want in. And I was able to sign 10 people into a 6K program. Y'all don't hear me, right? because I got in alignment. And as I was, you know, aligning my thoughts and my actions with what it is I said I was going to do, I promise you, it was the easiest sign up I'd ever had. I mean, the easiest. And I've walked through a year of that program and it's not about the program. I want you guys to bring me your mind and allow me to share the story with you so that you can look at your own situation and say, is it my thinking that's really holding me back from what it is that I desire to do? And so I was thinking about that process and I said, okay, 
for this next thing that you're wanting to do, this next huge leap in your income that you're wanting to do, what did you do before when you had a huge price increase? And so I started thinking about that. And then I started thinking about the year in that program and some of the different things that transpired and how some women just soared and some people not as much. And I understood that it was their thinking. So guys, for those of you who are believers, first of all, the scripture even says, as a man thinks, so is he. And so much of what you are and aren't doing in your life is based on your thinking. I had another incident today. So for those of you who don't know my background story, I was married for 14 years and about a little over two years ago now, I divorced. My daughter and I moved to a completely different city. She goes to a completely different school, um, which required us to move. So I am, you know, we're in, our, we're in a home now and I am currently looking for a home to buy. So today I went out and I looked at this property that I saw and it, it wasn't what I wanted. You know, I have things on paper. I have a vision, how I want it, what I want it to look like. However, it was at an exceptional price. And, you know, I contemplated in my mind and I was like, well, you know, I could, you know, remodel this and do, you know, this differently in the home. I was coming up with all these different things. And then finally, finally, I said, that's not what I want. It's, it's not what I want. Why am I even toying around with that thing that, that I really don't want? And so one of the things that normally transpires when it's something that we really desire, in the process of um, not having what it is that we want in our hands, we tend to settle, right? We tend to take less than or... Um, a lower opportunity or something that's not really even going to give us the results, the feeling, the fulfillment, whatever it is that we want in, in the process of settling. And all of it has to do with our thinking. And I, I have a program that I'm starting probably uh, maybe around the middle of this year. And it's going to be for women. And a huge part of it is centered around mindset. And I said, I want to do a beta, right? Now, it's going to be a premium course, but I want to do a beta. And I want to help a few women with their thinking. Now, mind you, I'm going to do it as a master class. It's going to be this Sunday. It's called As a Woman Thinks. And I want to walk you guys through the steps that I took and that I take even now because it's always a process when you want to go to the next level that put me in full alignment to be able to manifest things into my life that I desire. And I had to like do a self check on today and say, hey, wait a minute, you're out of alignment. You're thinking about things that aren't what you said and that's why you're not manifesting what it is that you desire. So I'm gonna give a few women, I'm not even going to disclose how many, right? I'm going to give a few women an opportunity this Sunday to join me in a masterclass as a woman thinks. It's going to be a beta for the program that I'm really going to launch uh, later on. And I use these concepts and have seen them work with my clients before, but I normally mix business with it. This one will be fully and completely about your thinking, about your mindset. Um, I think I'm going to not only do... Uh, the master class on Sunday, it will be Sunday at 8.30. But let me tell you guys the good part first. It's only 97 bucks. It's only going to be $97 because I'm doing it as a beta. It will be part of a larger program that I'm doing. And I knew that this would not be um, only beneficial to me, but many of you who come and do the master class with me are going to have so many mental shifts. And I want to see you guys manifest. Right? I want to see you guys manifest some goals and things that have been just sitting on the table. Or maybe that you've been afraid to actually manifest. So it's going to be this Sunday at 8.30 p.m. It's Eastern Standard Time. It's called As a Woman Thinks. It's a master class. I'm saying it's going to be about two hours. Um, however, I'm going to be open and answering questions, helping you guys uh, remove limiting beliefs 
and create new beliefs and then set intentions that are going to allow you to manifest. Now, I'm doing it at such a low rate because I do offer premium courses because it's beta, right? And I'm only focusing on mindset. And part of what I want to do for women, because one of the things I know is that our childhood, some of the things that we've gone through, some of our environments create these limiting beliefs for us. And we have to go through a process in order to change those beliefs, in order to change the results. And I wanted to say, I said, I'm just going to do a beta and I want to see how many people manifest things that they are, they've been desiring or that have been on their list. So if you're interested, if you feel that your thinking has been limiting you, using the words, I can't, that opportunity isn't for me, I would, but if those things like that have been holding you back from really manifesting the goals, if you got stuff rolling on your list, if you got this thing in your head, you've been saying, I kind of want that, but you're going to want to join me. Now, I'm only taking a certain number of people, and I'm not disclosing the number on purpose. And this is me kind of being selfish because I want to see if I manifest the number that I said. I will disclose the number in class on Sunday of the women that I said, this is just going to have to be the honor system. Y'all just going to have to trust me with the number that I picked in my head. But not only that, um, when... I've gotten that number of people, I will no longer send the link out. I will no longer send the link out. So if you feel that there's a possibility that your thinking has been limiting you from manifesting your goals, from making your bigger goals happen, you'll want to join me in this class. You're not going to want to miss this class. I have a client I was working with on Monday and we were looking over her numbers and what you know she's been hitting and she noticed that she wasn't getting, she had hit uh, $2,000 a week um, previously. And we were checking on the numbers now and it had dropped by maybe four, $500. And I asked her, I said, what do you think the difference is? And so I walked her through the same method that I'm gonna teach in the class, but not only am I gonna teach the method in the class, but the number of women that I'm taking in it is going to allow me to work with people. We're going to be in a group, a small group, but individually on what it is that they're trying to manifest, that they're trying to bring to pass in their life and in their business. And so uh, we realized that a huge part of why it had dropped back down was because of her thinking. So I walked her back through these four steps and she got back in alignment. And um, I can't wait to check her numbers because I'm almost 100% guaranteed if she's doing the steps that she's going to hit that goal or more. And I want to share it with you. I don't want your thinking to be the thing that keeps you from getting what you deserve and what you desire for your life and your business. So if you think this will be useful to you, then put me in the comments. I will inbox you the link uh, to invest. It's only 97 bucks. And then after that, I'll add you to a list. I haven't even created a list. I just created a button um, so that those who are ready to take fast action and wanted to make sure that they were one of the number of people that were able to get in would be able to do that. And then I'll create a list and you'll get a login number and we'll get to class. The class, again, is called As a Woman Thinks. And it's teaching you how to remove limiting beliefs and manifest on a greater, larger scale. For those of you, this sounds like something you, you're into or you would enjoy doing and being able to use over and over and over again throughout this new year and this new decade so that you can get some of those things off your list so you can manifest at a higher level so you can make more money, hit more goals and some of the things that you desire. I love, love, love for you to join me. That's my take, guys. This was completely uh, spontaneous is just in alignment with where my thoughts were I said hey you know I'm one of the things I'm doing is opening a course the middle of the year and I want to do a beta on one of the mindset principles that I'm going to teach inside that course and what better way to do it than to allow people um, a no-brainer opportunity to join and um, let's see what you can manifest you guys have a super super amazing day remember if you catch this put me in the comments I'll send you a link to be able to save your seat if you if it's not too late, if the number of people that I'm taking has not been met. 
And then at some point tomorrow, I'll send you a link to be able to get into the masterclass on Sunday. You guys have a super, super amazing evening. Peace.